Now the Road Trip series are smaller fixed neck travel guitars. Okay, so these aren't collapsible guitars, but they are very travel friendly. Think small car, think airplane carry on kind of a thing. Now I didn't travel with one of these guitars, so I don't know how it looks going through security or going through the gate. Uh, but I can say that these guitars, uh, their overall length is 36 inches. Uh, and in that 36 inch package, they've uh, added the 24 and a half inch scale length. So that's pretty awesome to have that full size feel in a guitar that's kind of small. Uh, under the hood, there is a uh, uh, forward shifted scallops X bracing, which makes a huge difference in tone. And they have quite a variety of options. If you go to their website and check out the Road Trip series, there's quite a few options. The two that they sent, uh, the first one, is their all solid, uh, rather I should say solid top and solid back Sapele guitar. Uh, the sides are actually layered. They're a laminate side, uh, but the top is solid Sapele as is the back. Comes with a pickup, again, 24 and a half inch scale, inch and three quarter nut width, extremely convenient and comfortable to play. I think it sounds awesome. I mean, for such a small package, it's a lot of sound coming out of this guitar. So that's the mahogany one. They also sent in the uh, solid spruce top and sapele back inside. Or, I'm sorry, solid spruce top, solid sapele back, laminate side again, also with the pickup, inch and three quarter nut width, 24 and a half inch scale. And check this out. It has that Manzer wedge design. So it's super, super comfortable. That's what I was talking about, that wedgie in the beginning of the show. Uh, so Linda Manzer, Canadian uh, luthier, developed this, this design that really eases tension on the shoulder because it's thinner on the playing end and thicker on the, the, uh, the lower end of the lower bout. So super, super comfortable to hold. Um, and since it is a travel guitar, they really put a lot of thought into the case. Uh, case is super durable. It's got a nice hard kind of uh, a wear resistant nylon on the outside, super padded and comfy on the inside. Uh, it's got these stretchable pockets where you can throw in gear, cables, mic stands, music stands if you want to. It even has uh, daisy chains on the side as well as uh, those kind of quick lock clips. Uh, so you can clip in a backpack or whatever you want to bring along to the gig. And uh, just wanted to feature those because I think for uh, those two guitars both go for $489. Um, it's quite a package for $489. Uh, and I think it's a great sounding guitar. A lot of the questions I get are like, Tony, what do you recommend? You know, Taylor GS Minis are awesome. Martin Dreadnought Juniors are awesome. And now we got these Journey Road Trip Series guitars are awesome. Well, I think they all have their certain niches that they fit into. I've been a longtime champion of both the Dreadnought Junior and the Taylor GS Mini, but I will gladly put the Journey Instruments Road Trip Series up there with them. I think they offer great tone. Uh, I think they're very comfortable. That wedge design is extremely comfortable for any of you that may have shoulder pain or don't love reaching around a guitar. And I think um, also the case that is included, I think is very worthy of mention because uh, I think a lot of thought went into these guitars and I'm, I'm pretty pleased with them. So uh, those are the Journey Instruments Road Trip Series. Go to check uh, those out at their website. Of course, you can get there through acousticlife.tv forward slash AT72. Uh, learn all you can about them. And uh, as I mentioned, uh, those two guitars are 489 off the website, and uh, that's for a solid top, solid back, the case, the whole deal. So uh, make sure to check those out. I think you'll be pretty pleased with them, and uh, I know I sure was. I was very surprised. I always go into certain guitars with a bit of skepticism, uh, especially because I love the GS Mini and I love the Martin Dreadnought Jr. But these, I think, uh, are carving out their own way and I'm pretty pleased with the performance of them. So again, check those out. Those are Journey Instruments Road Trip Series travel guitars and uh, there's quite a few of them on there. So make sure to hit their website. Again, find that through acousticlife.tv uh, forward slash AT72.